Hey everyone, this is Jason with localphotoclasses.com and I'm here to show you how to optimize your photos using Lightroom to upload them online to localphotoclasses.com uh, or anywhere online. So I want to quickly show you guys how to do that. So as you'll see right here, I already have my photos selected um, between the photos that I took in one of our landscape classes some people enjoying in the class as well as one or two uh, landscapes from the class at Sunset Glyphs. Uh, so once I narrowed down my selections, what I need to do is I need to con hit Control A or Apple A uh, or Option A on Macs and select all of these or you can just kind of uh, click one and hold down Control or Option um, to select all the images. However you gotta do it, just select the images that you want to export, that you're gonna want to upload online. And then what you'll do is you'll go to File and then you'll hit export. You could also hit Control shift e which is what I like to do. So this basically pulls up your export dialog box. So what you will do here is you need to select where you want to export it to. I usually like to select it, uh, select the same folder in which the photos are stored. Um, and so I'll just go ahead and do that. I will name the photo, uh, the folder Facebook because those are going to be going to Facebook or to localphotoclasses.com but the optimization is roughly the same. And then what I'll do is I'll go to File Settings and I'll bring my quality down to 80. Okay, that's usually optimized enough for web, but also brings down the overall file size quite substantially. Uh, one option is you can just hit Limit File Size 2, but I don't like that because then it leaves it up to the computer to decide size and all that kind of stuff. Usually degrades the quality quite a bit. Um, now this is the real trick. Click Resize to Fit, select Long Edge, and then put 2048 pixels at resolution 72. Basically, 2048 pixels, that is pretty much the highest resolution that you would ever need for any screen. And the resolution of 72 is just a low resolution for web use only, while still maintaining the integrity of the overall photo. Um, so right here, you'll see Optimize for Web Use. Um, these settings don't really work for print, so I wouldn't recommend these for print. Um, but everything else you don't need to worry about unless you want to add a watermark, uh, which you can just do here and you can edit or you know add a watermark if you so wish. And then you just hit export. And then it'll take a couple seconds. You'll see your photos exporting up here. And then you'll be ready to upload those online. You just got to find them from the folder you exported them to and then upload them to any destination you'd like to on the internet.